What are you doing? Are you trying to get started without me, buddy? Well, hang on, bud. We gotta do this together, okay? Because you can't speak English. Right. All right. So we are doing a couple of book talks for you guys today. And the first one is this really sweet graphic novel and it's called Copper. And it is by a, whew, kind of a tricky name, Kazuo Kibushi Shi, I believe is how it is pronounced. How do you think you would pronounce that, Mouse Bear? He doesn't know. All right, well, grab the other one for us, Mouse. All right, and let's see. This next one is called Fetching, a Middle School Unleashed by Kira Stewart. And this one, as you can see, is really long and actually has 296, uh, thank you, 96 pages. All right. So, and what both of these books have in common is that they are actually about dogs, either as protagonists or just kind of as a central theme, which means they're not, they don't have dogs as really characters, but they have like Dogs are like vital to the storyline. That's what a theme is, right? That's what it doesn't know. All right, well, let's dive right in and we will talk about Copper. Copper is a really great graphic novel. As you can see, it has all these just wonderful colors. Look at these mushrooms. Look at that. Look at that line, the curvy line in the mushrooms. Those are just really great graphic novel. And um, what's kind of interesting is it's called Copper. And you can see that there's a dog character, and there's a boy character, and do you think that Copper would be the name of the dog or the boy? I know, I thought it was going to be the dog too, but it actually is the boy, and you can see that he has a C on his sweatshirt. So, kind of interesting. And I think the dog's name is Eric. Kind of silly, right? A silly name for a dog, Eric. But... The way that this book is designed is really in comic book format. It's got lots of little pictures with little word bubbles. And it looks kind of long, but these are actually a bunch of different little stories. Like this page is a story all by itself. And this page is a story all by itself. But then there are other ones, which are a couple pages long. And those have like a longer storyline. And for one of them, this is called Lunch Pack, in which Copper and Eric are going out into the jungle, or maybe like the woods, and they have brought themselves a lunch, and it is really up to Eric the dog to watch the lunch. And what do you think happens to the lunch mouse bear? You don't know. Do you think Eric can handle holding the lunch? Or do they come across some enemies that might take their lunch away? I don't know. You'll have to read to find out. And this is a great book and it can be checked out at many of your local libraries. So go on down. Check it out. And the next book that we will be talking about today is called Fetching. And this is a really interesting novel because it is all about middle school girls and how horrible middle school girls can be to each other. And of course, you know, there's gonna be a ringleader and her name is Bryn. But then there's also kind of a leader of the uh, less than popular so-called pack of girls. And her name is Olivia. And this book is all about Olivia and her idea to train the mean girls. And what do you think, like what kind of like methods do you think she uses to train them, Mouse Bear? Right, like dog training methods. So that's really interesting. And if you've ever, ever seen, what is that show called? I actually don't remember. Do you remember? It's got Caesar Milan in it. And I think it, oh, it's Dog Whisperer. So if you've ever seen the Dog Whisperer, you'll really like this book because it uses all those dog training techniques to train the mean girls in middle school. But once Olivia has all those girls trained, what does she do next? It's really interesting. It's a really fun read. Even if you're not a kid, it's just so creative. And on the back, she's got it all broken down into the groups. There's the toy breeds of girls, and those are society's spoiled little darlings. The sporters, 
better on the field than off. Herders, always looking for a pack. It's really funny, really smart, very novel. And that is actually all that we have for you today. Mouse Bear, do you have anything else to add? All right, so let's just quickly wrap up. Copper, great book, graphic novel, all about the wacky adventures of this kid and this dog. And the dog is, what was that word we learned last time? Personified, yes, the dog is personified. So he talks and he behaves like a human. It's really neat. And then again, fetching. Middle School Unleashed. Great little pun there. All about girls, how mean they can be, and maybe a few ways you can trick them out of it. All right. Signing off. Mouse Bear and Aaron, please join us again. We will be back sometime next week with a whole another great group of books for you. Have a good one.